Um, another thing is we thought we were going to break the streak. Yeah, we did. Um, no, we did not break the we streak. We did not break the streak of grails. We are still going. Welcome back to another episode of Grown Kids TV with myself, Lindsay, and Mike. What do we have today? Today, if you can't see, obviously, these are the big boxes. They're from Spastic, so it's a Spastic big box hunt. Yep. Possibility for like a 10 inch Maleficent metallic. Oh, that'd be cool. Steamboat Willie, stuff like that. Now we have been on an absolute roll for grails. Yeah. It can't go on forever. Nope. It's okay if we don't win every time, but it would be really cool in this instance to get one of those. Yeah. All right. However, we did see this. I might have seen it on the thumbnail. Pretty big damage on this box. Yeah. So just this one. This one came in fine. So uh, I don't know. Maybe some. Uh, like I always say, some WWE practice moves from the Postal Service. Yep, doing the elbow drops. <laughs> doing the Macho Man elbow drop. <laughs> Before we get started, let's check out this featured Funko. I don't think I need to even say anything about this. It's perfect. This is the Jean Ralphio and Tom. And what's this from? Parks and Rec, obviously. Parks and Rec. So this one we got in a mystery box. Yep. I don't actually remember what mystery box it was. It was a decent amount of time ago. So yeah, I it was it either. was a while ago. But this is an awesome one, and it's doing really well PPG value wise. Yep. Like all the Parks and Rec pretty much are. Yep. Uh, and it was a great collection because we have Andy Dwyer, uh, we have Little Sebastian, we've got one of the Ron Swansons. Uh, so pretty excited to pick this one up. And then funny thing is this is Tom and John Ralphio. John Ralphio's character. Uh, the actor who plays him in this is now named Tom, I believe, in a new Space Force. And he's obnoxious in that one too. Yeah, he plays a very <laughs> similar character, which is Susan. It's a pretty good character. Yeah, yeah, I'll give him. To, I'll give him that. But I just love it so much. She's even got his little cupcakes, Tom, that says "Treat yourself." <laughs> I do love that. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to put a link from Amazon in the description below uh, for pretty much just pop television. Because uh, we like a good amount of TV shows. Obviously, Lindsay has uh, some Parks and Rec. She has The Office. Uh, so we do love a lot of pop TV. Yep. All right. Let's check out these boxes now. Yeah. All right. What we're going to do is one at a time. Okay. Because they're the big boxes. And we're going to go with Damaged One first. All right. And the damage is pretty significant. Like, you could open the box through this way. All right. We're going to skip that, though. So this is... $80. I don't know if we said oh, that yeah. before. $80 plus some shipping. Yep. And this one said Big Gamble. Yeah. I don't I don't know if there was a minimum value or how much it was, but they said, hey, you're probably not going to get your money back on this one. <laughs> uh, but we've been taking some gamble ones lately. Yep. So now we're going to see how it goes. Oh, I'm scared. Okay, so we got a paper on top, so it might be values or something, I'm not sure, maybe just an invoice, so I'm going to put that to the side in here. And feels like there is a big pop, I don't know what it is. Okay. But it might just be a whole bunch of pops because it's all wrapped up. Nope, that's one big pop. I believe this box is one big pop. Nothing else. Nothing else. All right, let's find out what this is. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's a big Thanos. It's a massive Thanos. All right, that's not too bad. So massive Thanos. I didn't know what to expect from this box. Okay. We, we, have, uh, we have a couple 10 inches, and this one is a really cool one. Uh, our 10 inches are, you can see in the corner, we have the child. Yep. And if you saw one of our future, one of our previous videos, we have the Joker, which mm -hmm. I love. 
And this one is actually pretty cool. There's a little bit of damage on top, which you expect something with these is just so much. Yeah. You know, to get damaged. But he has this giant sword that he has. I love the actor who plays him, Josh Brolin. I love uh, his first full length and the, the first of the two Avengers movies that has Thanos. And then the second one was, uh, in terms of Josh Brolin's character and how he played Thanos, uh, it wasn't really focused on that. The first one was, and it was amazing. Also, you forgot the fact that we have Frankenberry, which is like the best oh, tanning show we, we have. We do have Frankenberry. It's, really it's just barely up in the corner of the screen. So this paper, they put on the website that some boxes would come with gift cards to offset the cost. Oh! So we got a $15 gift card. That's not bad. Stick. Yeah. That's not bad. So let's see how much this guy's worth. All right, just got back from popriceguy.com. Uh, Thanos here, this guy's coming in at $37, so better than I expected. Yeah. Uh, these ones are a pain if you are into reselling. Uh, I honestly don't know how people resell these. I know. I we, know. Yeah, we bought one a while back for like $15 or $16, and there's no way that didn't cost that much shipping. I don't know. Yeah. But, <laughs> but uh, so $37, pretty good. Uh, and I think I might just take them out. That would be cool, yeah. He's got the Infinity Gauntlet on. Uh, I believe he's a big, yeah, he's a big bobblehead. He's got his sword. I like it. We're gonna have to find somewhere to put them. So thirty-seven dollars, and then a little bit of a spastic gift card to go with this. Yep. Which in reality we are gonna use no matter what. Yeah, let's we, be real here. Yeah, we shop on spastic all the time. In fact, two seconds before this video, I just picked up another box. I don't even know what he got. Yeah, she doesn't know what it is, but I could have used that. So this is pretty cool, and to offset the cost, they, they gave us this. That's pretty decent. Yep. We knew it was going to be a big gamble. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's a pretty cool pop. Let's check out the other box. All right, box number two. Very similar weight, so it might be one 10-inch pop. I believe it was like one to two pops is what you were going to get. Maybe it's Steamboat Willie. That'd be pretty awesome. Oh, here's hoping for the best. So this one's got peanuts everywhere. Oh. This one, uh, caught a glimpse of what it is. It's not Steamboat Willie, but it might be pretty good. Okay. It's not, it's not Maleficent. Okay. But there was a picture of six of the buggers. Okay. So, and it's got peanuts, so they might really like it. Oh, that's what I was going to guess. It is. And I'm actually pretty excited about this. It is the bloody Daryl Dixon. That's cool. From Walking Dead. It's a Gemini Collectibles exclusive. Wow. It looks awesome. In the picture they had these, and I honestly didn't know they were like the full size ones. <laughs> You're so cute. Because they, <laughs> they had these pictures of Freddie Funkel and the two Daryl Dixons. Um, yeah, I don't know how much this is, but it was in the picture, so it might be really good. Yeah. Plus, it's just, it's so cool looking with the blood splatter on it. I do love, oh wow. And it's got the handprint on the side. Yeah, I love that about the Walking Dead boxes. Yeah, that is really cool. So really cool detail. That is on. awesome. So let's check, let's let's find let's check out. out this bad boy. All right, we just got back from Pop Rice Sky. A few things. Number one. The reason I thought that the three in the bottom part of the picture, and I might put up a picture here, uh, were smaller is because this actually is shaped like the regular pop box. Like, I didn't even notice until he pointed it out to me. Yeah, for example, uh, all the 10 inches that we have, right, they're plastic on both sides and it's a whole clear window. Yeah, they don't have this like they do on the normal pop boxes. Yeah. And this is, a, this is slightly smaller. I wonder um, what size it is. Yeah, I don't know if the character if himself is smaller. I don't know. Or just standing up higher? Either way. Okay, so that's one thing. Another thing, now we know why he is in the picture. Um, another thing is we thought we were going to break the streak. Yeah, we did. Um, we no, did not break the we streak. We did not break the streak of Grails. We are still going. This thing is ridiculous. Now there is a little bit of box damage, yep. right? Uh, there's a very small crease. Well, it's kind of hard to notice 
but you can yeah. tell with your with in person. And same on this side too. There's yeah. a crease down there. I think. And you that can see that, that one's one yeah, that one's a little bit yeah. You can see that. But easy. other than that, for such a big pop, it's in really good condition. I really these like. These boxes normally get pretty. Yeah. Big. I really like that it's in shape of a regular pop with the face on the front and the half yep. half plastic around the side. And now for the huge surprise. All right, here's a confession. We didn't look up the pop prices ahead of time. No. Uh, I no. know Maleficent Metallic is probably insane. I know it's worth a lot of money. Yeah, I don't I know how much. We didn't expect to get that one, so we didn't really look it up. Uh, we didn't really expect to get any of these. Um, yeah. And I didn't know anything about this. I, I know that uh, Daryl Dixon's usually do well. There's a couple comments, but there's a lot that do well. Mm -hmm. And this is no exception. Uh, now, without any further ado, the PPG is... $290. Blew me away. I didn't expect it. Yeah, I started scrolling past and I saw like the regular version of this and I was like, oh, that's probably it. And it was like $85 and I was like, that'd be pretty cool. Yeah, I was like, that'd be really nice. And I saw the, the one of the bigger ones, I think it was one of the bigger ones, going for like 100 something. And I was like, wow, that would be awesome. But it's not that one. I kept scrolling and we got down, it's 290 then we said, hey, let's see, because there's so few of these, we don't know how, you know, one might have sold six months ago that really threw off the price. Yeah. Um, but we just said, hey, what's the most recent one it sold? And there's only one sold uh, on all of eBay. Yeah, from and the UK. From the UK, and it was... 500 plus 50 shipping. $500. And there's one for sale for over 400 Yeah. So this is insane. Plus, I think it looks amazing. It really does. I love the bloody pops. They just, they look so cool. That's an I'm, awesome. I'm just, I'm blown away again. And it's really nice because it's much less likely to run across the fake one of these. Yeah. So it's like, hey, we got this, oh, we got this guy. And not many people are going to be like, you know, you don't have to worry as much. This is a 2013. Wow. I thought it was much newer than that. I I mean, by box condition, I wouldn't guess that it was a 2013. Yeah, like, it's pretty crisp. Like we said, a couple creases, but pretty crisp. Yeah. So I can't believe it. I honestly wasn't expecting it. No. I thought we were going to come down off our, our amazing, you know, grail. I think we're five grails in a row, and this would be six. We can say it now because they've seen the videos. Carl and Ellie. Carl and Ellie. And then we got... Heat Miser. Heat Miser, you can count that. Jam Jay. Master J. Yep. And then uh, Two Face. And, and Red Skull. So this is our sixth in a row. Six in a row for mystery boxes, and we bought Corona Ellie ourselves. Holy. Cool. It's all because you bought Carl and Ellie. <laughs> it's not all because I bought Carl and Ellie. You don't even know that. That's what started it. Exactly. It's, it's all because everybody hit the like button for that Tony the Tiger. Yep. Which was like one video before this, so we're at like we're at like six, we're at like seven out of eight. That's pretty insane. Oh yeah. man! It's all because we gave away those grails. Yep. That's what we're getting. We're getting grails it's, back yeah, because we gave away grails. We, somebody paid it forward. We paid it forward by accident. And now we're getting it all back. But this is insane. I didn't expect this. No, I, I was thought, expecting a fun pop or yeah. two. And we got a gift certificate. <laughs> Deal. All right, spastic. Oh, out of this world again. We we've been we've been fans for a long time. This might be my favorite big pop. I like Frank and Barry. I like I like Joker. I think he's cute. Daryl Dixon is not I, really cute in this. I do think this one is really cool though. It's really cool. I, I don't get a cute factor. For some reason, Joker just really comes across. As cute. <laughs> Joker is cute. And obviously, the child looks. Just adorable. All right. Sorry, we're rambling again because we did it with the help of Spastic. I'm really glad we opened it second too. Me too. Yeah. Because we're like, oh my god, this is crazy. <laughs> Thanos is pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> Throw it out the window. Which no. Thanos I am happy about because that's we're probably coming out of the box and it's gonna be you know somewhere in the house. Yeah, it'll be a cool display one. It'd be really funny to put like in cupboards and then scare people when they come over. And I know I've said it so much already, guys, but thank you so much, Spastic. For real. You've been watching Grown Kids TV. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later.